Hi, it's Jake at Canadian Cutting Edge, and today we've got a mail package unpacking. Not really unboxing, because they're not boxes. <laughs> and uh, thanks for stopping by. And I uh, haven't done one of these for a little while. Let's see what we got today. Today I've got my trusty Spyderco Tenacious to uh, give me a hand. We've got, <laughs> I thought that this was going to be strange when it came out, and uh, it is. Look at this. We've got uh, San Ran Moo's logo right there, and on the box, see that? Kershaw Cryo. This is uh, the San Ren Moo 1555Ti. Um, San Ren Moo is the company that makes the Kershaw Cryo for them. And look at that. It says Kershaw right on the knife. So if you've been looking for a Kershaw Cryo, here it is from San Ren Moo for, oh, I'll put the price on the video. I think this is $15 US prices from straight from San Ren Moo. Um, I don't believe it. I thought it was going to have um, San Ren Moo's branding on it. <laughs> Clearly it has Kershaw's branding on it right there. Hinderer design. Oh, nice pillar back there for your lanyard hole. And yes, it's this is a cryo. Very nice. Oh, I was not expecting that. Not at all. Wow. Well, hey, now that I got it in my hand, I've played with you tenacious for a while. Come on, cryo. Let's see what this next package has. Next, next, blah, let's see what this next package has. Oh, knocked it flying. Oh, <laughs> I caught some paper and that's what made it go flying a little bit. Um, oh, this isn't a knife. Uh, this is just a package of, uh, I don't know why I bought these. These were on at uh, Dear Best. They're these, uh, they call them rattlesnake eggs. They're uh, just magnets that, uh, good strong magnets. Just something to play with. All right, this last package feels more like a box that might have a knife. And let's see what's in there. I didn't think I cut it open, but I did. A uh, piece of paper in the way again. Also from San Renmu, San Renmu, model GB8-707. GB8-707. I'm not even 50 years old and I've already got trifocals. Hoy vey. G10. Coated blade, slight recurve right there. Feels pretty sharp. Liner lock. Flicks pretty good right out of the package. Clips not super deep carry. Three quarters of an inch would be sticking out, I think. Tip down carry, no option for tip up. Oh well. Open pillar construction. Some nice silver pillars on there. This feels like a nice secondary carry. I like to carry a plus 
over three inch knife. And I like to carry, you know, a three inch or smaller, smaller style knife. Um, this one looks like it's at least three inches. Oh boy, am I way off. No, I'm not way off. The actual cutting edge, so from the tip of this cutting choil to the tip of the blade is two and seven eighths inches. So it's just under three inches um, liner lock. Nested uh, liners, nice. So what do we got today? We've got a Kaiser, thank you to San Renmu. We've got a, uh, I was just checking out the coating. I think this is very the similar treatment of coating on these two knives. And I got my rattlesnake eggs, these magnetic ones. Cool, those are gonna be fun to play with. So that's what we got today. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for checking out our channel. Uh, if you like this video, please click on like down in the lower right hand corner and down in the lower left, uh, you can share with your friends. And please subscribe, I appreciate that a lot. And the best part of us, the best part of this network is the comment section. Please leave a comment. I really appreciate it. Thanks for stopping by. Have a great day. Remember, always cut towards your chum and not your thumb. Bye now.